Previously on Delos, we complete our eight-day voyage from Namibia and make it to the tiny island of St. Helena. It reminds me a lot of like islands in the South Pacific actually, like yeah. in the middle of fucking nowhere and then there's like a little settlement in a town and everyone is super, super friendly. Like. So we had a bit of a joel yesterday. <laughs> And I think all of us are feeling a little bit tired today. Oh, What's God. wrong, Mr. Brady? Oh. My brain pain hurts. You're a little hungover. Yeah, I had a lot of rum. We pre-gamed with a bottle of rum and then went out and probably drank another three or four bottles of rum and then vodka. We drank that bottle of rum before the sun even went down. Yes, ma'am. But Brian is awesome and he cooked us an amazing breakfast. Look at this breakfast. Mmm. Wow. Pancakes with chocolate strip uh, chips and strawberries. He's done very well. We all wake up, we've got a coffee and a cup of tea in hand. You love that, Brian. He looks after that. Luxury, well. huh? Luxury it is. And the water is warm now, which means we can go swimming in the morning. Hey, mate! We're cruising now, we're having breakfast pancakes. Not gonna get it now, I'm eating pancakes! I will get in later though, because it looks fantastic. What is this swimming person? What? <laughs> have a random swimming person next to our boat. Such a good swimming <laughs> What are you doing? Um, uh, putting down the Quebec flag because we are all clear. Oh. And we are officially uh, immigrated in the United Kingdom. Dun, dun, dun. Da -da -da -da. So no reason for this yellow flag. But what, do we have good... Uh, St. Helena flag. We could hang up Elizabeth's pillow. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about that? Good idea. She would be stoked. <laughs> Elizabeth. Hello. We need to hang your pillow from the starboard shredder. This? Yeah, because we don't have an English have flag. So. Oh, uh, we will the flag. Channel one six, yeah. And we will relay the message to Whisper and the, the two. Okay. Four, four crew will come ashore shortly, thank you. <laughs> I'm just kidding, dude. Brian! <laughs> <laughs> such a dick! Can't, you, can't hang your pillow from the spreader, man. Well, we bought a bloody shower curtain with a permanent marker as my bloody flag. I don't know. <laughs> I won't put it past you. <laughs> Alex Blue, look at you. I got two. <laughs> What did you do? That looks blue. I put Nutella on the pancake and then I put syrup on top. Nice. It's pretty good. It's a good day. Great day. What do you want to do today, Kazatron? I want to lace around and then I want to go swimming. And then I want to lace around. Okay. Should we get out the snorkel here? Yes. Now you're wasting film. Precious film. <laughs> you fuck up! Baby! Baby! Go! Kick her, kick her in the butt! I will! Just and go! Then, you're gonna yeah. go anyway! Oh. <laughs> How does it feel? It would have been far more liberating if I chopped in off my head record. What are you doing in our garage, bro? There's a lot of shit back there, huh? How much gear have we collected over eight years, man? We have every size of fin. We have different types of fin. We have booties, we have masks, snorkels, everything. We're going snorkeling today. Yeah, I'm going. I'm gonna swim over to the rocks. Get this little girl from Dunedin, cruising from the Midlands, mate. And how did 
the chop squatter shoot! Port Elizabeth, a seaman's town. An old seaman's port. You got it. You got it. Trevallis, it was amazing. And two shipwrecks. Yeah. Did you go all the way down here? No, we went that way. Oh, you went this way? To the shipwreck up there. Cool. It's really cool. Where'd you see the turtle? Right down by there. the shipwreck. What? It was so nice and I dove down and swam next to it and he just looked at me like... <gasps> and he just kept on swimming. Oh! Yay! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> She loves turtles. She loves turtles. She loves turtles a lot. I know it's not for me. The sea calls me. I'm a rolling. Rolling and rising right like we're born to die in the rolling Rolling and we rising right like we're born to die and ba Lisa, I love it when you make the schnitzel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my, we really have a hammer. <laughs> in, in <laughs> that's a proper Austrian kitchen tool. With a a hammer. hammer. Yeah, mm. things I popping know. out of a hammer that, yes. that you can go deeper into the meat. It's just a normal kitchen tool. It's not a proper Wiener schnitzel because a proper Wiener schnitzel is with uh, Kalbfleisch. No, we're eating schnitzel with potato salad. And the potato salad is kind of a recipe from my mom. I hope I did it in her in her. Everything you cook is fantastic. So. Yeah. Really good. I'm holding Brian's plate away from him because he's eating his dinner before I was Lisa told to eat it before I got a cold. And then he was told to be put on hold. Put it down. Wait. Put my foot down. Good night, Saint Helena. We'll see you in the morning. It's been a roly poly morning. There was like a squall the last day or two. And our nice anchorage here has become like really uncomfortable. Everybody's working on the boat this morning. You guys do it here. Hey. You guys want to go do a little walk ski up Jacob's ladder? Get off the roly poly boat for a little while. Yes. Look at Elizabeth. She's like, "Is there a pub at the top? I want to go because that's." You lied room. to me. You said, "Oh, there's a pub at the top," and I inside was like, "You're lying, Brian." Oh, you're learning. <laughs> She's learning slowly. <laughs> Mr. Brady, mm. it's almost time. It's almost time for Jacob's Ladder. Yeah. Good. So we are going to, this is the Rolly Anchorage by the way. We're going to go up there. Ladder Hill takes its name from a famous Jacob's Ladder, built by the Royal Engineers in 1828 as a direct, if rather alarming link between the fort on the cliffs and the town below. 
699 almost vertical steps and the longest staircase in the world. Islanders tackle the heartbreaking climb slowly. They use a curious swinging gait and heave themselves up by the handrails. Going down can be much quicker for those who are prepared to risk the world's longest banister slide. Coming to shore here is pretty tricky compared to most places in the world. You have to avoid shallow wrecks, mooring buoys, and floating lines are everywhere. And then you have to deal with the often big swell crashing into the rocks. Go to the wall, bro. All right, attempt number two to get on the island. <laughs> on the wall, you just uh, the ropes that are hanging, grab onto those. Why don't I hop off first, and you guys can throw me all your stuff? So the landing here is like super sketchy and cheap vests as we are, we don't want to pay, what is it, two and a half? Yeah, I think it's two pounds for the Two ferry. pounds <laughs> per person for the ferry each way. So that's like a good lunch. Yeah, it adds up if we're trying to go in and out every day, right? We got ashore safely, but it's definitely sketchy. Like one of the sketchiest places I've ever landed, the dinghy, right Brady? Yeah, it's pretty sketchy. If you get the wrong swell, the dinghy goes from water level to two meters higher and then you get thrown onto the dock, so. I know it looks flat calm right now, but the conditions can change really fast. St. Helena doesn't have much in the form of a protected port or bay. Big open ocean swells have a straight path into the harbor and then smash right into the dinghy landing. Check out this recent footage of what happens to the landing when the swell does come up. Not fun. And those lines are for if you want to swing onto the boat when it's real bad. But of course, it's always been like this. Jumping from bobbing boat to slippery steps is a hazard for the visitors. But if Napoleon managed it, so can Aunt Flo. And after generations of dealing with the swells, the locals have no problem maneuvering the ferry boat to drop people off. We have 10 backpacks of camera gear. It's like, ah, oh, let me just chuck this bag up really quick. But he said that the swell sometimes goes up, up to here, like over this wall here, which is absolutely insane. Like, then people jump and you just grab onto these ropes and hope for the best. You can't really anchor the dinghy, so Brian swims. Good dive, right? Good dive. <laughs> the boat came out from under me. <laughs> sure. I am an underwater explorer. I need to wash off a little bit anyway. Good job, Brian. And then Ma Maggie's safe out there with all the other boats. Yeah, should be alright. 
How excited is everybody to climb 699 steps? How many was it? 699 yeah, six steps. Nine. Yeah. 699. Yeah. What's the record? 5 minutes Five and minutes 20, 20 seconds. Yeah. Something crazy like that. Yeah. 5 minutes. Should we time it? Do yeah. anybody bring your phone? I've got my phone. Yes. I don't even have the phone. <laughs> <laughs> you're, out, you're out sailing with us. Yeah. What were you doing? Well, I was sitting up there on the bow, having a good old time listening to music and uh, Snapchatting like a douche. And then <laughs> Fair enough. The Shouldn't universe. Snapchatting. <laughs> There's one. The universe gave me a little slap in the face and I dropped my phone in the water, so it's time to start drinking. <laughs> As well. Yo. Oh, I'm gonna be drunk if I do too. Well, you've lost. Well, you've lost Just your phone. Yeah, Neptune demands it. <laughs> you mean you, you're a big girl? You can make your decisions if you want to take that right away. <laughs> yeah! Alex Blue. Oh. Is the big girl. She's rubbing it in. Shame. Shame. Oh, can we use your phone? No. <laughs> Neptune's using the blue Sweet. Side. Let's climb the ladder. So the island's kind of funny because anything that's here has been here for a while or someone's tried really hard to get it here because it's all had to be brought in by boats. So there's some really cool old school cars here. And this one's pretty sweet. <laughs> I thought it hit your head. It was quite low. Well, it did hit my finger. Yeah. Did it cut you? A little bit. Hi. <laughs> Shay. <laughs> Shay. <laughs> did it break? We lost one propeller. Well, didn't lose it, but. Shame. It's okay, we got a lot of good footage and didn't lose the drone. Okay. We finished now. Back <laughs> up with it. Hey. I don't, can't say that I'm very fit. Whew. Yo. Look at that butt. Good butt. <laughs> it's a good butt shot. We're almost at the top. It's like 15 steps left. One, two, three. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Seventeen point three five point six seconds. Seventeen minutes. Seventeen and a half minutes. Send my love down the power line. Oh, nice. What a view. Nice job. How did that feel? Good. Yeah. It was great. It was a good challenge. And now it's over. <laughs> it's over, Brian. Is that on your knee? No, Ben. I washed it off. I washed it off. Uh, okay. I threw up at the top. You have I'm to sorry, I didn't hear you. I have to say it again because there's a car going by. I threw up at the top. 
it was like we kept a brisk pace. We had a couple of mini breaks, and they got to the top, and I was just going to Alex. Oh, I feel I feel a little bit sick. And then I just went to the bathroom, and <laughs> when I thought I was done, and I straightened up, and I was sick again. I was sick all over my leg, all over the toilet. <laughs> I was like, oh, shame. Shame. <laughs> just shame. throwing loads of water everywhere and... <laughs> that is shame. Yeah, I don't keep anything from the Delos family. He came out and said, I've just been sick. <laughs> How about the Austrian pirates? That's nice. Yeah? No problems? Not hiking up, but we will see when I walk down. Okay. You guys ready? Yeah, let's do this. Cheeseburger's calling me. When you were kids, you used to slide down like this. <laughs> I don't know, bro. Yeah, something like that. Oh, dude, that looks so dangerous. <laughs> the teenagers keep up with the times, thanks to the radio and the local cinema. We Fine. shall call you the vomiteur. No, <laughs> we'll wait till I get down, Brian. We'll just wait. Do you want to slide down? No, not like that. <laughs> hey, Elizabeth, good job. Can you look like I'm your penis then? What'd you say? Right. Yeah, I heard you say penis at the end of whatever you said. Oh, like you're standing on my chest. Oh, okay. <laughs> she did say she did penis. Say penis. <laughs> that, Brady, use your core. Your use your core abs. Bring your button. There you go. There you go. Look at his little wiener. Down I already got one. Look at his little wiener sticking up. <laughs> there you go. Now go like this, cousin. Uh, Brady, straighten, oh. those, straighten those abs. I'm not done with this fucking pose. <laughs> All right, I think we got it. Oh, great. How's that, Kazakhstan? Woo! Cheeseburger time. To the pub. To the pub. Do you guys want to tell us about Anne's place, please? This is the, the yacht club of St. Helena, I think. <laughs> Local cruiser hangout. Local cruiser hangout. And it's set in the, the town garden, the castle garden? Castle grounds, yeah. Castle grounds. Do you know more about it? Come on. What do you know about Anne's? I think it's super old. First built in the late 1600s and then added on to over the years. Crazy to think of all the people who have passed through here over the last 350 years. And Anne's place was built in 1980 or so. Since there's no yacht club on the island, it seems like it's grown into filling that role. We've heard from everyone that it's the best place around for a cheap burger and beer, and pretty much the only spot on the island for Wi-Fi. They also have very, very, very slow internet here. And expensive. And expensive. But they have delicious, delicious cheeseburgers. How's that bacon avocado salad? Absolutely delicious. That was pretty good. Mexican burger. Hit a beer. <laughs> How was yours, Blue? Really good after that hike. Uh huh? Mm hmm. We basically, she gone. worked out for like, like 25 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> we deserve burgers and beer. That's pretty good. <laughs> It was an intense 25 minutes. Next up on Delos, 
we go on the first of many hikes on St. Helena. Experience our first dive of the season and have the first Delos radio show takeover. I don't know if it's coming out. Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> Both my speakers have turned okay. out. Fade in and. Good fucking fade, mate! Like it? I like it a lot.